Hi, everybody. Dawn here, a.k.a. Miss Ella Bella. Wait, wait, wait. Hold up. Yes. You are looking at another baby that has bloomed in my nursery. I just love the way that sounds. It's springtime and it sounds so good. Anyway, I wanted to show you guys somebody, a little girl, who is sitting comfortably in the stroller, just resting, looking at me. I am so glad that she is feeling better now. Let me tell you, this is the Page Kit, which is a bounceful baby kit that I got when it was on sale. I wanted, I just absolutely always love the eye, the eyes on this kit, and I figured I want to make this kit. It's a very petite kit, um, but I really, really like it. Um, she's wearing some a runzy that I took and put some lace and material at the top to give it more frill. I added these two bows and that pretty much is her outfit. She gets so cranky all the time and then she had a it was been very warm. The weather's been going up and down and she caught a really 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 bad cold. Look at her nose just rubbing. She's been rubbing and rubbing and rubbing. Her eyes are all glassy and but she's still so cute. Okay, let's just talk about the doll for a second. Um, She's a redhead. I don't know if you guys can really see the color. She's a redhead. I used some hair that was really a lot more coarse than what I came out to be a lot more coarse than I thought it would be. Um, It was synthetic hair that I had was like kind of reddish. I was trying to make a redhead. Um, originally it started as a boy and I kept looking at him in the nursery and I felt like oh no he's not gonna make it in this nursery it was bothering me and once I changed him to a girl I instantly knew like oh my gosh that's why I went wrong but the hair is not the way I want it to be so when I put the bows on there you know bows and frills always help to blend things in or disguise them so that made a big difference however it did not take away from her cuteness though because in general in general she is a very cute baby to me. And I absolutely think that she is adorable. I don't know her name yet. So right now I'm just calling her Paige. So um, here she is. For those of you that don't know, just to recap, um, don't know that. When I do paint, I use um, air dry paints. And it's been a constant journey for me trying to get it right. The thickness right, trying to avoid chalkiness. And I always like to come and show you guys my babies, even if I think they come out the worst. I always show you guys because people think that when you first reborn and you make these dolls, that every doll is going to be perfect. The fact is that there are going to be mistakes. They are going to look crazy sometimes. And that you just have to keep going and find out where you fit. Stop looking at other people's babies, trying to figure out how they got that look. And you trying to do it. Just go with what you feel. And eventually you're going to come out with something that you really, really love because you're working out a technique or something that works for you. Anyway, I'm starting to rant when it was all about this sweetie pie right here. I will definitely talk to you guys later. Bye.